My question is, I think the, I think the reason Spark is exciting to a lot of us is the idea that uh, we can do what we do today with the do map reduce and more. So it can totally replace a do map reduce, but we get all these other things for free. Um, if my data, and, and I know that maybe that's over the right now. Hopefully. <laughs> it's a dream. Right. So today, if my data is twice as big or ten times as big as my available memory, and my algorithm is not iterative, do I still want to stick with Hadoop map reduce and, and for how long? Or, or can, is, is, is Spark at all competitive for that use case? So I would say that in that situation, you would probably want to, want to I'll be a board worker here and say that this this is what Tez was was intended for. It's, it's sort of the next generation there. Um, the reason why is because Spark was intended to work very well within the constraints of memory. That being said, it, it does degrade gracefully. It's unclear with the maturity currently what the performance implications are of that. I would say the question it, it's unclear. Um, one of the nice things about Spark on on uh, whether high on Spark is it will be clear very soon. So, so I've done some experiments with this and it, it it degrades gracefully. So an example, if you if half your stuff is in memory, you can avoid that. And I don't know if you're aware, but there's many ways to store data in RDDs. Um, you can actually store it serialized and compressed in an RDD. Right. So that really is a huge bang for your buck. And most data you, you compress with GZIP, yeah, you're going to pay a compute problem, right? But compute is nothing compared to a hardware problem. I mean, uh, yeah. So there are options, but even if it can store a percentage of that data in memory, that's less I.O. But no magic, right? Right. It's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to help as much as you can. If you don't have a working set in memory, if you're not going to be able to use the cache, you're not going to be able to use the cache. But is that a use case that Spark is uh, driving towards still, or are they going to... That's probably one of the... I mean, it's, it's not the biggest it's not, the biggest, it's not the biggest selling point right yeah. now. Yeah. Right. Um, they want to be able to function. Um, they want to be able to function without substantial grading. I suspect the, the beauty of Tez is because is that you now it's competition. Right? So we're going to see those things compete. And, they're gonna, and, they, and, they, and both of them are going to 